Welcome to College Football Legends, where we dive deep into the stories of the game's greatest heroes. Today, we'll embark on a five-part series listing the top five running backs of the Big 12 Conference. The Big 12 has been a breeding ground for legendary ball carriers, and the competition is fierce. But it's not just about statistics and accolades. It's about their heart, determination, and a sheer love for the game. This is not only a countdown, but a tribute to those that have shaped the game that we love. So whether you bleed the colors of your alma mater or simply revel in the glory of the game, join us as we celebrate the men who embodied the heart and soul of this conference. So Without further delay, let us dive into our first entry of the top five running backs of the Big 12. We begin our countdown with a player that displayed a rare blend of power, size, agility, and athleticism. His accomplishments were legendary and is remembered as one of the top running backs from the state of Texas. This is the story of the late, great Cedric Benson. Growing up in the small community of Midland, Texas, football is not only a sport, but a way of life. The book and critically acclaimed film Friday Night Lights features the rivalry between Midland Lee and Odessa Permian High School. The Midland Lee Rebels have a storied history of high school school gridiron success. However, their crosstown rivals Odessa Permian and a host of East Texas powerhouses such as Austin Westlake and Dallas Carter had dashed their hopes of total victory. As a 15-year-old freshman, Cedric Benson was about to take the high school football landscape by storm. As the physical prototype for a running back, Benson shattered multiple Texas high school records. In 36 consecutive games, Benson rushed for over 100 yards with a career total of 8,400 yards and 127 touchdowns. He was nearly impossible to tackle by the average 17-year-old. After years of Midland Lee following short of a state championship, Benson led his team to an unprecedented three consecutive state championship titles. After posting an undefeated season, the Midland Lee Rebels were voted the number one high school team in the country. This solidified Midland Lee as one of the most dominant programs in history. Cedric Benson's ball carrying ability attracted attention from nearly every college program in the country. In addition, his overall athletic ability was displayed on the baseball field with a batting average of 360 and was drafted by the Los Angeles Dodgers after graduation from high school. With opportunities to pursue the professional ranks as a baseball player and scholarship offers to play football, Benson was faced with a tough situation. Ultimately, he chose to stay in his home state and play for the Texas Longhorns. Benson's success from his historic high school career translated directly into achievements at the college level. A powerhouse such as the Texas Longhorns is loaded with talent at nearly every position. Therefore, it is common for freshmen to see little of any playing time. This was not the case for the highly touted newcomer Cedric Benson. The coaching staff was blown away with the ability he displayed as an 18-year-old freshman out of high school. In his very first season at Texas, he rushed for 1,053 yards and 12 touchdowns, earning Big 12 Freshman of the Year honors. After a breakout freshman year, Benson posted a thousand yard rushing performances in every season as a member of the Texas Longhorns. His individual accomplishments included the Doak Walker Award as the nation's top running back. In addition, he was selected as an All-American and First Team All-Big 12 Conference. His contributions at running back, along with fellow Texas Longhorn legend quarterback Vince Young, helped lead his team to an 11-1 record capping the season with a victory against Michigan in the Rose Bowl. Most running backs that possess talent similar to Cedric Benson leave college early to enter the professional ranks. However, as a testament to his loyalty to discipline and hard work. He stayed the entire duration of his eligibility at Texas and earned a college degree. As the top running back prospect, Benson was selected in the first round of the 2005 NFL Draft by the Chicago Bears. To put it bluntly, his career in the National Football League was the opposite of the story success he experienced in high school and college. Some would say that his off-the-field choices affected his play on the field. Others would say that his dynamic yet physical running style took a physical toll on his body. His rookie season as a pro was cut short due to injuries. He grew accustomed to being the featured player on his team. He battled for playing time with former Virginia standout Thomas Jones, who possessed similar abilities. Due to injuries and inconsistent play, the Bears chose to trade Benson to the Cincinnati Bengals. After years of underachieving as a pro, he experienced success posting three consecutive seasons rushing for over a thousand yards. Despite finally avoiding injuries and contributing to the Bengals' success, his off-the-field legal issues led to the Bengals organization declining to renew his contract. It's safe to say that his career as a pro did not go as many would have expected. There are no guarantees that college success will equate to success in the National Football League. Tragically, Cedric Benson lost his life in a motorcycle accident in 2019. Although he is no longer with us, he remains a legend of the college gridiron. That concludes today's entry into our countdown of the top five running backs of the Big 12. Please comment who you think will appear in our next episode of this countdown. If you enjoyed this video and would like to continue this countdown, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel. By subscribing, you'll never miss an episode of College Football Legends, where we celebrate the unforgettable players and moments that define the sport we love.